and gentlemen, please welcome your host for the evening, Hassan Minaj. Hello, how are you? Good evening. Good evening. Thank you so much. Welcome to the 77th Annual Peabody Awards. I'm your host, Hassan Minaj. Thank you guys so much for coming. And I give yourselves a big round of applause for winning. Yes. 77 years ago, this award show was created with the simple idea to honor excellence. And it's evolved into this amazing tradition, an event that celebrates storytellers, whistleblowers, reporters, folks on the front lines, people who aren't afraid to hold the powerful accountable, who aren't in it for the celebrity or the power or the money. So where should we have this event? Wall Street. <laughs> Let's do it on Wall Street, baby. <laughs> Am I the only one who noticed? Every year it's on Wall Street. This is the wokest award show in the least woke location. <laughs> I swear to God, the last people to sit in your seats were toasting to the rollback of Dodd-Frank and EpiPen price gouging. <laughs> you know, just public interest stuff. <laughs> I love that joke because this is the only room that joke will work in. <laughs> Seriously, why are we awarding the Peabody's on Wall Street? Are the Pulitzers being handed out at Mar-a-Lago? <laughs> Neil, you can't do these jokes at the Emmys, man. It'll just go over everybody's, they just read deadline articles, they won't know. But I'll be honest, folks, the venue doesn't matter, it's just a room. What truly matters are the stories. That's what tonight is about, stories. That's why I love this event. As you know, the Peabody's aren't like other award shows where a host comes up here, they open up an envelope, actors come on stage, and there's fake drama between their colleagues, oh no. When you win a Peabody, you find out in a far more dignified way. Email. <laughs> you find out you win a Peabody the same way you unsubscribe from Old Navy. <laughs> I'm honored that my special homecoming king won a Peabody this year, but when my publicist called me, yeah, it was great, but when my publicist called me, she was like, Hassan, you won a Peabody. I was like, I did? And she was like, yeah, check your spam folder. <laughs> Dude, Kenya Barris, still doesn't know he won a Peabody for Blackish two years ago because the University of Georgia still has his Yahoo address. Dr. Jones, get on it, okay? In a few years, Dr. J is gonna be just texting the winners like, yo, you up? Be like, is this a booty call or did I just win a Peabody? <laughs> now originally, the Peabody's existed to honor excellence in radio broadcasting. Then they expanded to television, then cable. As technology evolves, so do the Peabody's, and they've come full circle by adding podcasting to the mix. That's right, podcasting. Yeah, who knew ZipRecruiter and MeUndies would be funding the new wave of journalism? That's right, suck it, Comcast. Casper Disposable Mattresses are funding the resistance. <laughs> it is truly an honor to be hosting this year while you guys eat dinner. Um, I've really made it because this past year has been a massive win for accountability. We are living through a long overdue reckoning called Me Too. People tell me this all the time. Hassan, you've had an amazing year. What's your secret? Honestly, I just didn't sexually assault anyone. It's amazing how far not being a criminal will take you in life. <laughs> the bar could not be lower, fellas. <laughs> and change is, how low is the bar, Yvonne? It's, the, it's here. All because change is happening. All because women are speaking up and their stories are being shared. And it is a testament to the ethos of the Peabody's that stories matter. Stories ranging from Oklahoma City to Aleppo, from marvelous comedians to crooked attorneys, stories about Rohingya refugees, white supremacists, and daring dreamers, even stories about vandals drawing giant dicks on cars. <laughs> that is why we're here. When we talk about hearts and minds, we're talking about the Peabody's. When we talk about accountability, we're talking about the Peabody's. And when we talk about irony of location, 
we are talking about the Peabody's. Are you guys ready for a great show? <laughs>